Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the third and final of a series of three singles matches to determine the three men that will compete for the VWA Television Championship at Wilderness War. George Thornberry and Alan McAfee. We're going to kick things off here. George Thornberry making his entrance. George Thornberry eliminated in round one by Zach Jeffers from the VWA World Championship Tournament. And Alan McAfee eliminated in round one by Josh Andrusik in the VWA World Championship Tournament. As the bell rings, and we kick this one off. George and Alan, I don't even need to go into the history here. The previous company we all worked for. These guys certainly had a rivalry. Alan's going to start things off with a sleeper hold. Gets behind George. And again, a sleeper hold. Looks like Alan's going to break out the submission holds to try and wear this one down early. Alan with an Irish whip to George. Into the corner goes George. Goes for the spinning wheel kick. George able to dodge. George with these straight jabs and these kicks. Quick strikes. Alan gets behind him. Oh! Big spinning wheel kick to the back of the head of George Thornberry. George to his feet. These guys sizing each other up. George was standing the kicks from Allen. George with an Irish whip of his own. Puts Allen into the corner now. Allen able to get behind George. George reverses. Gets behind Allen. Allen reverses into a Russian leg sweep. Fast-paced technical offense from both guys. Which is standard from both of these guys. Allen with an Irish whip. Beautiful Hurricane Rana into a pinfall attempt. George able to get the shoulder up. Allen with a chop. George gets behind Allen. Lifts Allen up. Beautiful back suplex there. George now with an Irish whip to Allen. Beautiful monkey toss from George Thornberry. Allen rushes George. George throws him off his game. Irish whip into a hurricane rana. This time from George to Allen. Allen lifts George up. George lifts Allen up, excuse me. Irish whip to Allen. And oh, George with a drop kick right to the leg. That's smart by George. You can see Allen uses his feet and his legs for his offense all the time. George is smart to. Oh, and again. George is smart to go for the legs. Allen re-enters the ring. George Thornberry. Irish whip to Allen McAfee. He, oh my gosh! George with a running high knee, and it's going to take Allen clear out of the ring. And there's George with a huge side... Uh, looks like some sort of hand hook. Quick offense from George Thornberry. And there's George. Look at these quick knees right to the gut. Oh my. Knocks the win right out of you. And there's a jumping running knee. Alan McAfee gets to his feet, headlock takedown. And again, Alan and George know each other very well. These two guys have a lot of history together. George with a beautiful German suplex into a pinfall cover. Alan gets the shoulder up. These guys have met in previous singles matches many times in the company we used to work for. So like I said, there is history. Spinning wheel kick from Alan. There's a kick. Exchanging of strikes. There's Alan. The spinning wheel kick puts George right into the corner. There's a chop there. And another wheel kick that puts George right back into the corner. George coming back. But Allen is able to keep the strikes quick enough to keep George in the corner. But there's George with a, a hand poke, as we like to call that. Allen reverses it. Oh, and another spinning wheel kick to George. George to his feet. Goes for a leg sweep. Allen able to withstand the blow. There's a chop. Allen's got George now. Look at the Hurricane Rana from Allen into a pinfall attempt. George able to get the shoulder up early. And now George countering with these knees again. Oh my. Allen gets to his feet, but again, those knees will knock the wind right out of you. Oh, drop kick, and again, right to the back of the leg. Allen with an arm drag. George knows the offense Allen likes to, likes to use, and he knows how to, how to counter it. George to his feet. There's another huge hand poke to Allen. Allen countering of the... Look at this. George, a beautiful monkey toss. And now George has got Allen. Nice front headlock there. Allen forces a break on the ropes. Allen with a kick. Holds George in. Nice headlock takedown. Lifts George back up to his feet. Allen looks like he's going to start bringing in some power moves. Whoa! Looks like he was trying to roll George into a submission hold. George was able to counter and again using the knees, hitting Allen right in the gut. 
That was a great counter by George. He lifted him up. Alan McAvee reversed into a snapmare, which kind of has George dazed a little bit, it looks like. George was able to dodge an attempted wheel kick by Allen, but Allen still able to land an arm drag and a big jumping elbow drop. Fast-paced offense from these two guys. And now George, look at George, rolls Allen into an ankle lock there. Allen's got to find a way to get to the ropes or else escape. Look at, oh man, Allen, he is able to escape, but that is the offense from George Thornberry. He's working on the leg of Allen. There's a chop and a kick from Allen, but George able to counter with a hand poke. Vintage George to go to work on those legs. George to the top rope. What are we going to see here? Uh, <laughs> I think George saying, never mind. Too much of a high-risk move. But lands a series of quick strikes. Irish whip to Allen. And a beautiful monkey toss after an Irish whip. George lifts Allen to his feet. Allen's a bit groggy. Oh, what a big jab. Knocks Allen clear onto his ass. Allen to his feet now. Able to recover. Goes to the Irish whip. Georgia with a reversal. And again, a drop kick right to the lower shin area. Allen back in the ring. And George catches him. Irish whip. And a huge high knee. Allen's groggy, but he gets back into the ring here. Allen McAfee. Oh, look at this. Shin kicks right to the face. And a jumping elbow drop from Allen in an attempt to get some momentum back here. Nice kick. George exchange with a... A front jab. Allen with an arm drag. These two guys know each other so well. There's Allen with a kick. Beautiful drop kick by Allen McAfee. And another front drop kick. Rapid succession drop kicks by Allen McAfee. That is vintage Allen right there. Oh, but George counters with that drop kick to the knee. This is where George is at his strongest. Oh, what a huge strike to the back of the head. And look at George. What a German suplex by George Thornberry. Allen slow to get to his feet. George showing off the agility. Gets behind Allen. And now George has got him. And again with these knees right to the midsection. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Look at the... Oh! George is feeling it. George knows he's got Allen exactly where he wants him. This is danger zone. George puts Allen into the corner. What are we going to see here? Oh my gosh. George going for it this time. And look at the spinning Hurricane Rana! What a move. And George is going to hold the shoulders of Allen down. And he's going to get the three count. George is going to beat Allen. Wow. Earlier in the match, George went up to the top rope, but he, it looks like he abandoned the attempt. But not this time. Allen was groggy. George saw the opportunity. High drama, high athleticism. George Thornberry, look at this. A beautiful seated Hurricane Rana. And that kid, that might have knocked Allen out cold. Allen might have been out for a few. And George knew it. And so George goes for the cover. And that's going to do it. Let's get, this, let's get this one more time on replay. What a move by George. Look at this. This will be a nice side angle. Look at the athleticism here. Wow. Oh my goodness. And that's going to do it. And with that, I can officially announce that the three men to compete at Wilderness War for the VWA Television Championship, J.J. Sulik, Russ Robinette, and George Thornberry. Again, J.J., Russ, and George are going to meet in a triple threat match to crown the first ever VWA Television Champion. Thank you for joining us, ladies and gentlemen.